very spooked. Okay. I'm only getting to four with a Prismatic Vista deck. I don't, I, I got nothing. I don't know what happened there. Must have just gotten very unlucky. All right, well, I think we're pretty well equipped to just start slamming. Uh, love. Thankfully, our sponsorship was able to get up, get everything we needed for us. Honestly, it was, it's very, very feel very fortunate, very lucky. Um, I did buy some forces. Oh, show and tell. Yeah, that could be it. Yeah, card order, man. I uh, they chose not to shuffle. Spooky. Uh, they do, yes, but I don't think that's what's happening here. I'd be very confused if it was. All right, well. I'm not here to not slam. Intuition, spooky. Well, they can't draw cards. Even if they do resolve the show and tell, so I can... If it's a Crystal Brain, I can plow it. If it's a Emrakul, I can Oko it. If it's an Omni, I die, probably. Yeah. Oof! Alright, well, here we are. I'm going to do the... Yeah, I got nothing. Oh, man. I'm not dead, exactly. They attacking. One, two, three, four, five, five. So you can draw Caracas? That doesn't win. I need to draw. Yep, okay, that's game. Ah, uh, unfortunate. All right, well. Want that, 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 want this. All right, so our opponent is likely to have um, shifting ceratops. Which is spooky.
Let's go with this. Or let's just way too slow in this matchup. I have to play first. Yes. Keep. Did I take out my trophy? Uh, it does not hit the dino. The dino is per green. Or pro, pro blue, I'm sorry. Wait, is it? I don't actually know. Shifting ceratops. It is pro blue. I'm dumb. Yeah, I definitely should have uh, boarded in the Omni. Oh well. I, I'm I'm hanging in there. I barely know most cards. I don't know, dude. Also, why did I stack that that way? I'm confused. What am I doing? Seven Narset on top of my library. Yeah, pretty much. I'm getting pretty tired. This will be probably this will be my last match for the day. I I can't even blame on that one. I think the 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 play was just really poor. <laughs> I don't know what happened there. No, I'm not here to make excuses. That was just bad. I'm going to wait to the main phase brainstorm, I think. Actually, no, the payoff is so high if I brainstorm here. And I hit. I can go get forest with this later. Um, I have to let this resolve. Unfortunately, if they have if they have the um if they have veil, which they are likely to, yeah, I don't think I would have defended that. I think I might defend the next one. We'll see. What did the exile a ponder? Yeah, this is such a bad spot because, like, if I yeah. Brainstorm resolves. This means what to fairy or mentor? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's usually Teferi, but I don't know, I'm out of practice. It could be random other cards I don't know about. Resolve? Resolves. Deal. Give me a spell. Oh, I actually wanted that labeled. Oops.
Oh, that's actually really bad. Hang on. If they have a Ceratops here... Wait, no, they can't give it. If they had a, a Soul Land plus a Ceratops here, it would have been really bad for me. Well, this is a Force Play. Here comes the Veil. I'm not going to put anything in. Sure. Yeah. No, there's no Savannah. Um, take the thoughtsies actually. Oops. All right, that's fine. We've we we live to play another turn. That was devastating, actually. That was really fun. Um so I was hoping to bait a force of will or something with the Thoughtsies. I wanted to clear their hand because I thought their hand may have been a force of will. Was the main rationale, but we out here. Oh, yeah, but don't kill me. Eladomri's call? Okay. Oh, here comes the Ceratops. Oh, Quaddle? I will blast that. It's going to take me forever to attempt to kill them. Yeah, I know, to give it haste, but I think they have another land in hand. Dino Spooky, all right? Yeah, it used to be more popular back when I actually played uh, Legacy at the time. Pre Uro. Yeah. Uh, I can do that next turn. Actually, I should have done it this turn. Crap. Yeah, you're right. Mm. That might be a huge problem. I was hoping to save it for force fodder, but... Yeah, I didn't think about it increasing the clock. Lizard brain moments. Oh, wow. Okay, cool. Surprising. Surprising. All right, I want this card back. I can move this one out. Actually, no. Yeah, it's the plow. MX. Uh, 
hinder me, yeah. Legally allowed, yes. Oh, man. I think I'm gonna do better. Moderately better. I'm gonna bottom the swords. That's a good draw. That's a good draw too. I mean, it's an okay draw. It's a it's a way to deal damage. <laughs> Which is pretty important in this matchup. I'm definitely playing this on turn two. Or at the end of my opponent's turn. This is just a slam on turn three. This plus containment priest doesn't work the way on it one or two, correct? Yeah, it's a cast. Sure. Yeah, that's what I thought. All right, come on, Marcus. Well, now I get to just sit here and ambush Viper, my opponent, and hope that's good enough. I'm going to go ahead and brainstorm now, though. Wait, no, I'm not. I don't need to really worry about... I don't want to get rid of anything yet. Sure, if they want to trade, that's fine. Yep, that's fine with me. Sure. I'm now going to end up in Brainstorm because my whole, um, my mana is now cramped a little bit, so I'm going to go ahead and end a turn Brainstorm, getting a forest. Oh, neat. Um, I'm going to keep this alive.
yeah my mana and my like spell sequencing is is currently cramped so See, I'm not gonna do anything to defend this coming because I can't. So <laughs> here we are. Sure. I don't know how many quadrals my opponent plays, but I'm not gonna risk the cannonist anymore. And I have an Oko coming, so I can. I have. I have a clock already. Plus, my opponent's Uro doesn't matter anymore either because of the Caracas I drew. So I feel in an okay spot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm very happy with casting the, um, the Narset there for sure. I'm playing the Sylvan Library on my turn. Cunning wish. Sure. So it's getting something spooky, probably. Oh, okay. They're going to try to plow my cannonist. Yeah, I'm going to do that next turn. I wanted to get the library into play. Because I figured I needed to force. I was going to have to force soon. I wanted to get another defensive card. Which I found. Uh, do I ever need to keep the Caracas up? I don't think so, right? Thank you, Solnox1, for the follow. Yeah, I don't think I need to worry about the Caracas. That's fine. They get to cycle of fail. And then end of turn, I will brainstorm unless they force me to force. Which it seems like they likely will here. Is this a shifting ceratops? Seems like it could be. And then trying to figure out how to cast it, maybe? Uh, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, so they f that's fine. I have a Caracas.
So I think that is game. I don't think they can come back from this. <clears throat> A sleeple. I have sleeple on the table, friend. Oh, they have a quaddle. So maybe it's not lethal? 3-3, three, three, they block. Yeah, they have a quaddle to survive. That's fine. All right, well, I'm going to go ahead. Yeah, I'm going to cast the Quaddle now. Oh, I didn't do the math. Maybe that's true. Oh, I should have shuffled. Well, I think we'll be fine regardless. Our opponent can't really beat a Force of Negation, I don't think. Or this weird tempo deck. Is this tempo? <laughs> yeah, actually, yeah, you're right. I could have swung out. They couldn't block the cannonist. Blocking Ballista for X equals 3. Good games. Right. Excuse me, so 4-1 after a slew of terrible play. Um, I... I don't really have a ton of feedback to give in terms of deck list besides uh, play tighter <laughs> on, on, my, on my own part. I think I probably could have won the game, the match that I lost if I had played a little bit better um, and evaluated things a little bit more quickly than I did, which is, uh, I mean, it happens. That was my first league back in months. Um, the deck list seemed pretty, pretty solid overall, for sure. Um, I don't have a ton, like, the, the Felrar Retreat, I think I should have boarded in my first match against Delver also. It's hard for me to evaluate this card, but it makes sense if you think your win conditions of Oko and Uro are taxed in some fashion. Um, I think our, opponent, our opponents were overall really good. Uh, that Death and Texas match, I think, was a little bit of a wash, unfortunately, for our opponent. Um, I think there was a couple of missequences there on their part uh, that I, I, at least I don't... I don't fully understand why they did some of the things that they did. Uh, and if I maybe were to see their side, they could, uh, I, I would understand a little bit more. Um, yeah, overall, uh, it's good to be back. A 4-1, our first time back is not bad at all. I'm very happy about that. Um, and hopefully as we go, keep going, I'll probably play uh, this through another league uh, tomorrow. Um, or play Snow Miracles or some other fair food deck. <laughs> yes, that's very true. Um, I don't know. And I, I want to play things I, I know a little bit of before I, as I ease myself back into the format before I pick up something brand new and just kind of run with it. Um, which I definitely will do. Um, both Max and I will bring you folks uh, plenty more video content as we play more Magic and um, kind of get really excited about card hoarders and, and their sponsorship and helping us out here. So look forward to, so no Urza Echo tomorrow. Probably not. Um, that's definitely on my list of decks to try. So after I play, and I think another League of Snowco, and then a League with Snow Miracles, um, I think then I'll probably play something a little bit more off the beaten path. I, I think I'll probably be playing Esper Doomsday that I know that Max wants me to try. Um, and, and and then I'll move into something a little bit more non-blue, maybe. I think uh Death and Taxes, I think as a deck I would definitely wanna wanna give a shot. 
Uh, I think the deck is really well positioned, and it's actually the reason why I'm back in the format. Um, so, yeah. Thank you all so much for watching. It's been great uh, having so many people coming in, chatting, helping us out, and just hanging out and chat. It's been it's been really fun. Uh, thank you all so much. Have a wonderful rest of your Thursday, and we'll see you hopefully tomorrow. Bye.